today I'm in sunken land and I am traveling 12,277 kilometers per hour in this little clip here. After I did a little research, uh, many others have stumbled across this as well, and I'm going to show you how to do it. You'll probably stumble onto it by accident as well, but I love game exploits, so let's go. First thing you need is the wooden sailboat, the simple wooden sailboat. You drop your sail and you start traveling. Now for me, dinner was ready and I pressed escape and I paused it and I went and ate dinner. And then when I came back about 30 minutes later and I unpaused the game, it yeeted me all the way across the map. I was not recording at the time, so I'll show you now. It is 8.25 p.m. and I'm gonna go eat dinner and I will be right back. Okay, it's 8.52 and let's resume the game. 104 kilometers per hour now. I'm gonna have to freeze the frame and see how fast this is. That is absurdly fast. So it was fun. Uh, it was a little bit unwelcome, but I do love a good game exploit. So let's exploit it. First thing you need to know is that it's based on how long you press escape. Build a sailboat, orient yourself to the place that you know you want to go, drop your sail and start sailing, and pause it for an incremental amount of time. I'll show you now. So I'm currently at the Civic Center, you'll see here. Something I'm exploring and considering uh, building a base on. And I want to travel to the trading outpost. What you need for this is the wooden sailboat. I have not tested it with the paddle boat or the motorboat or the jet ski or anything else. Do let me know if it works for all of the vehicles. I've oriented my boat in the direction that I want to go. I'm going to press pause for maybe 7 to 10 seconds, give or take, depending on how far you want to travel. I'm currently going 94.7 kilometers per hour, and I unpause it, and I'm traveling at about 1,800 kilometers per hour. And here's the trader here, in a blink of an eye. You can also feather the escape menu, because you do slow down fairly quickly. I'm now down to 75.7 again. So if you feather the escape menu, it'll keep you above 100, 200, even 300 or 400. I did try to make a macro on this and uh, it didn't quite work out the way I wanted, but experimentation is warranted. This is a cool game exploit. Get it while it's hot before it gets patched. Cheers. Have a good day and I'll see you in the next exploit video.